Adam Heinzen here for WLCSports.com with a victorious Warriors group. Head coach Mike Ensley, sophomore Drew Wempner after the Warriors sweep Rockford in their final home match of 2024. Coach, it's been a long time coming. How does it feel? Oh, it's I can't even put it into words. You know, uh, especially for our seniors, I'm sure as well. Four years, we haven't been able to get over that hump for a uh, conference win. Uh, and to be able to do it on our own home court, uh, their last uh, home match of the careers, it, it was it's surreal. It's pretty cool. And then you jumped out solid. You, you never trailed in the first two sets. Um, talk about those first two sets. Your team was able to put it on Rockford and, and lead wire to wire in those. Yeah. Um, you know, every for, since about halfway through the season, we've been giving ourselves goals kind of running through it. One of the ones that we worked on was tra- chopping the game up, chopping each set up into five points. And so, um, you know, we've had some big leads here, especially at home, where we've ended up losing those sets. And so we wanted to make the game much smaller. So we did win to five, win to 10, win to 15, and so on and so forth. And I think that that bode well for us uh, in that first uh, two sets. Uh, We just started a little slow in that third set, but, you know, the resilience that this team is starting to show and being able to do where they can fight through even big deficits, um, come back to win, um, and have the... You know, the strength to do that so it was it was pretty cool let's turn to our sophomore outside hitter drew Wempner. 16 kills a match high the second highest of your career um talk about the offense today and what was working for you to be so effective um well me i just kind of swung at the ball i, I just kind of thought i just hit it as hard as i can that's kind of what went through my mind but no we did a good job of like making sure everyone everyone was getting kills we kind of spread the ball fairly evenly throughout the match so i think i, I got the highs but everyone else had a good amount of kills so it's kind of good just keeping the offense spread out and I think that was big for us today. How does it feel, all the work that this team's put in, you know, the results necessarily haven't shown. You guys have been really competitive, but today to get over the hump and get that first conference victory, how does it feel? Oh, it's such a great feeling. You know, what, this is my second year in the program, having one conference, first first conference win, and I'm hoping we can get a lot more uh, in the coming years. Conclude with Coach Mike Ensley. Two road matches then next week before you put a bow on the season. Um, what what does a win like this do to the guys going into the, the two road matches next week? Um, I think it's very big. They're both Illinois Tech and Benedictine are uh, you know the tournament teams right now for the conference, um, and we're both on the road. Um, so you know I think the confidence just coming from this, knowing that we can beat conference and we can you know stay with teams. Um, we've been hitting that point slowly but surely throughout the year. Um, this has kind of been that nice little cherry, but I still would love to, nothing greater than trying to upset uh, on the road. So we're going to get back to work uh, after Easter and, and just get ready for those two tough teams then. Again, the Warriors with a 25-19, 25-21, 25-22 sweep over Rockford here in the home finale. Happy Easter, everyone, and thanks for watching.